it feels great. I mean, it's behind me now though, so we can look at the rest of our season. And my teammates really did a great job helping me get there. The night was really exciting. We were happy to be home. I mean, it was a little bit of a stretch. She needed 29 points, uh, so um, and she ended up getting 31. We're really excited that she was able to get it home. Um, feels nice to pass the torch. She's a great player. She's really helped um, kind of solidify Newton as one of the better teams in the area. And her with the senior class and the class before, it just feels great that she kind of has that this accomplishment to take with her. Normally when someone gets their 1,000th point, it, you get there close, maybe 10 points away. You were a, a bunch of points away and you put up 31. What was your mindset going to that game? Did you have any idea what could happen? Um, I had somewhat of an idea. My team really wanted me to get it at home, so they really pushed to help me get it. Just talk about you know what it takes to get to that thousand point. I mean, you've been playing for you know three years on varsity, and you played on some really good teams. So when that happens, you know you don't get as many touches as some other players because everyone's good. Talk about that. Yeah, I mean last year's team was great. So like it wasn't just me who was scoring; it was everyone. But we. That's what helped us succeed. Everyone was scoring. And in years past, it was my teammates just helped me. She's built a lot of trust in her teammates, and I think it speaks volumes that she um, has scored a thousand points, but she's also had some talented teammates as well. You know, people that we had, you know, three girls averaging double figures last year, close to it. So for her to able to reach that milestone when she had such a great supporting cast says a lot. She works on her game. She's a basketball player. That's the sport she plays all year round. Um, and she's grown with each year and she wants the ball in there and she is a, she demands the ball and she also scores it against um, in clutch situations. So um, she's just really a testament to um, what Newton says, because she plays both defense and offense tremendously well. Over there on the wall, there's all the thousand point scores. What are your thoughts when you know eventually your picture is going to be up there with the Cape Brennans and the Bridget Brennans and the all time leading female scorer in the area, Linda Cordes, the great tradition Newton has? Um, whenever I pass by there every day in the hallway, you always glance at it and look. But and it's going to be weird that I'm going to be up there. But I mean, I know some people up there, so it's pretty cool. And how cool is it that you can share this with your coach, Whitney Dugan, who was the last Lady Brave to get 1,000 points when she was a senior? It's pretty cool, I guess. I mean, <laughs> she's really been supportive, so it's exciting.